वेलकम बैक प्रॉब्लम वन पॉइंट सिक्सटीन सो स्टेटमेंट इज द वुडन मेंबर ए बी आर टू बी ज्वाइंट बाय प्लाईवुड स्प्लाइस प्लेट्स दैट विल बी फुली ग्लूड ऑन द सरफेस इन कंटेक्ट एज अ पार्ट ऑफ द डिज़ाइन ऑफ द ज्वाइंट एंड नोइंग दैट द क्लियरेंस बिटवीन द एंड ऑफ द मेंबर इज टू बी वन ओवर फोर इंच डिटरमाइन द स्मॉलेस्ट अलाउेबल लेंथ एल इफ द एवरेज शेयरिंग स्ट्रेस इन द ग्लू इज नॉट टू एक्सीड वन ट्वेंटी पी एस आई सो यू कैन सी दिस इज wood a and this is wood b that is glued together with this ply woods the gap or clearance between a and b is 1 over 4 inch and allowable sharing stress in the glue is 120 psi so you have to find the allowable length l so we have to find this l length length l this is the length so let's start with the solution so if you look at if i draw this wood a if from fr frontal view this is a and let's say there is a small gap and this is wood b clear and these are the two plywood pieces same is over here clear so now you can see that this is the load 5.8 kips is applied i will show it over here this is the load p which is 5.8 kips and same with the upper one 5.8 kips so you can see that there are four areas one is this one the second one is this one third one is this one and fourth one is this one so these are the four separate areas that are glued so what we will happen is is this load will be distributed i will show with in white color so due to this the load in b will be in this direction load in b will be in this direction clear and here will it will be also in this direction in a it will be opposite to this load and the load in this uh, upper one this this will be f let this is f so same load that is glued with this surface will be also opposite to this force and this will be in this direction here it will be in this direction and here this will be in this direction same is the case in this direction and in this direction so i will write that uh, there are four there are four separate areas separate areas that are glued that are glued and each of these areas these areas transmits one half of one half of 5.8 kip force i will repeat it you can see this is the load 5.8 and this is 5.8 so here this total load will this f 2 f will be equal to 5.8 so 2 f will be equal to 5.8 kips so f will be equal to 5.8 divided by 2 now we have this force and uh, this length is the total length which we are interested to find out clear let this length this length this small length this portion length is represented as small l so i will show let this length is small l which is glued so i will write let l is equal to length of one glued area and width is given as you can see width is here this is 4 inch of this plywood so width is 4 inch so area will be equal to 
area will be equal to length into width so it will be equal to 4 times L now average sharing stress average sharing stress tau is equal to sharing force per unit sharing area so this is the sharing force f and per unit area and uh, this tau is equal to f by a so we are interested to find out area a so area is equal to f divided by tau and this area is equal to 4l clear 4 into l so f over t so this small length l glued length will be equal to f divided by 4l so f is given as uh, f we have found 5.8 divided by 2 5.8 5.8 kips so we'll convert it to interest power 3 divided by 2 clear and divide by 4 times this is 4 ta 4 times ta and ta is given as 120 psi so when you calculate you will get this length will be equal to 6.0417 inch so it means this length is 0. Point, this length is 6.0417 inch now you can see that now you can see total length total length l will be equal to you can see this is the total length l which is equal to small l plus this gap c and the same this small length l so it will be equal to 2 times l plus c so you can just put the value 2 into 6.0417 plus c c is 1 over 6 1 over 4 inch that is given 1 over 4 inch which is 0. 0.1 over 4 inch so after calculating you will get the total length required will be equal to 12.33 uh, inch which is the answer and that was all about problem 1.16 inch we have calculated this total length l and i hope you have enjoyed this video and you have learned from it those who are new to my channel then subscribe it and hit the bell icon so that you can get notification about my latest video if you have any question you can ask me in comment section thank you